Right now, an aide at a senior living facility is facing several charges of theft after Pasco County detectives say she stole from several residents. News Channel 8's Jamel Lene joining us now live from the Atria Windsor Woods. That's where we know at least two people were victimized. Well, good afternoon. I can tell you that the employees here, they have keys to go into all of the residents' room. And detectives say that Jessica Campbell went into the residents' room here and pocketed all kinds of jewelry and then pawned them. Detectives say last month, Campbell went into one of the rooms and stole $300 worth of jewelry. She pawned it at a state pawn. And last Thursday, that victim was able to identify her belongings through photographs. A couple of weeks ago, detectives tell us Campbell also went into another room and stole two rings, a bracelet and a necklace, all worth $20,000. She sold those items for $300 at your friend Ben Pawn Shop. The victim in this case was able to identify her belongings at the pawn shop. Now we spoke to people who have loved ones living at the facility. One man told us his mother believes some of her items were taken. These people are so vulnerable. Yeah. My mom is, you know, and it's wonderful because they have a group of wonderful people who really take care of them and, and they get to know them so well and they kind of depend on them. Yeah. But they could depend on the wrong one, right? Now, Campbell was in first appearance today. She is currently charged with burglary, grand theft, and dealing in stolen property. Rod? All right, Jamel and A reporting live for us in Pasco County. Jamel, thanks.